Hello, everyone. Ah. RBG, get him, get your back. It's more Unicorn Overlord. In the previous video, we made our way to the second continent, or second country, whatever, in Drakenhold. We have a few things here that we can do. We have a couple of things here to do. Um, and, yeah, I'm actually very excited for this. Uh, so, yeah, off screen, I did do this mission uh, quite a bit. Try to get some of our u new units up to snuff. And, yeah, and went great. And, yeah, we got, actually, a lot of our units are... Uh, everyone, I believe, should be at, like, at the lowest level should be 13. There might be a couple of actual units. I'm not talking about the, um... I'm not talking about the people that we hired, like, uh, Gutierrez and Arnott. But, yeah, so the lowest level... Oh, well, Prim is still at level 12, so... Or 11, I mean. Okay, yes, there are some outliers, but majority of the people are there. But anyway, we're going to do a couple of these things first before we do our scary, so. Uh, especially there's one that I'm very looking forward to. Uh, Elaine hasn't said so much as a single word to me today. Just a sensitive affairs, my lady. He's a cruel man indeed to toy with your heart in such a manner. And he did show us great kindness in overlooking our past dealings with Zenoria. Perhaps the queenship lay... Melisandre desires is not a d as distant as it appears to be. Oh, should she marry to the royal family, none would remain to assume leadership of the noble house Milate. What are you mumbling about over there, Calm? Um, it's almost time we head off to bed. Have you ever considered the impending existential danger to your lineage, my lady? No, frankly, and now is not the moment to discuss inheritance. I've almost died once in this war, and there's no telling when it may happen again. As it stands, Elaine's mercy is the only reason we still live. So for now, I wish to fight at his side, even at risk of my own demise. <sighs> Suppose you make a fair point. I wish I had more time to tend to my apprentice before he rode into e each new battle. Oh, my appearance. I cannot bear the thought of Elaine seeing my hair in a mess and my unblemished skin. Ah! <coughs> Joking. Skin covered in disgusting sweat. Is that not precisely why I stand beside you, my lady? We really say the word in the midst of combat, and I shall ensure your appearance as fair as the light of dawn. Us, Prince Elaine, shall only ever gaze upon you as your absolute best. Come, please. If you attempt such a thing on battlefield, neither of us will live to tell the tale. But enough of this frivolous talk. If I ever hope to court Elaine, I have no choice but to fight on, and that's precisely what I plan to do. Now, come, calm. We'll need our Angie for tomorrow. Oh, of course, my lady. Rest well. I'm very interested to know about the possibilities of the, you know, the, um, the possibilities of the, um, um, the Levit interests and such. And luckily, the next report is right over. Oh, it's worth the staring, kid. And don't have guards unstuck my beard. Not at all. I was thinking you remind me of a warrior. Actually, from an old legend I heard years past. And as the story goes, he was a frequent drunk and would spend many of the evenings deep in the flagon of mead. Yet he did so in secret, not wanting others to learn of what he perceived of what he perceived as a shortcoming. During the day, however, he felt countless enemies as an unparalleled fighter. The uh, reactant one, at that. I put on a few words and even fewer friends. Until one afternoon, local band received a plan to finally lay the great warrior low. He treated our hero to a round after round of potential drinks, thinking it a means to deplete the man's strength. Yet all that slackered was the warrior's in inhibition, and he spoke freely and eloquently while subduing the bandit. And as rumors spread of his enduring deeds, he was quickly beloved by everyone in town for them that, that day forth. <sighs> Some story, kid. What's it gotta do with me? I've never quit, and I'm not all that beloved either. Only thing we have in common is the drinking. As well as your dauntless strength, and you are well loved, I might add. I admit I've also seen you steal a few swings of ale before battle yourself. And then you noticed that. I'll not tell you to stop either, as long as you remember to exercise moderation. 
battlefields, no place of life's luxuries, of course, but depriving ourselves entirely is a certain way of damaging morale. <laughs> Don't worry, I won't take that kindness of yours for granted. And once you're king, maybe you and me can share a drink to celebrate. I look forward to that day, Mordon. I really wish that they released proper um, renderings of all the characters. Because Mordon is one of the characters that I don't have a proper rendering for, which I've been using for my thumbnails. Which would be great! Because the way I, I do it is, it's a little, yeah. Oh, here we go. This is the one I was looking forward, forward to. Here we are, then. Are you ready to begin? Do we really have to do this, Melisandre? I'm sorry to say we do. As Elaine's old friend and my greatest rival for his heart, I have no choice but to defeat you. Now come. Today we learn who can fashion the ensemble Elaine likes best. <laughs> Uh-oh. What a gorgeous pendant. Do you mind? I saw it first. Fire, you were just off buying a necklace at the shop next door. Very well. I'll just have to sell with the bracelet beside it then. But that's the one I was looking at. It matches Elaine's eye color almost perfectly, see? Wow, I'll be completely honest. It did not seem like Scarlet was all too, you know, into the whole, oh my gosh, I can't. Do I think she has a crush on Elaine? Of course I do. But I honestly didn't think it'd be like the, this extreme of like, uh, with this. I was just thinking the same thing, actually. Fine, you can have it. I'll look better on... It would look better on you anyway. Are you sure? I am. But I want that sapphire brooch instead. <sighs> Why do our tastes have to be so similar? It's strange, Scarlet. Despite the competition, I rather enjoyed shopping with you. As did I. Let's do it again sometime. But maybe as friends instead of enemies. I mean... <laughs> it was cute. It was cute. Um, is it just between these two? Yeah. Uh, that was really cute. I like that one. Again, it's a, the whole the way Scarlet was acting surprised me a lot. Is that you, Monica? Looks like it's been an ages since we last saw each other. Good day, Lady Melisandre. I heard your house has aligned itself with the liberation, but I never expect to see you march amidst our ranks yourself. I'm no lady with you, just an old friend. Though I admit it's hard to think that ten years have passed since the banquet at House Nordheim. A lot has changed in that time, of course. But I'm glad to see your hair is just as radiant as gold, uh, gold as always. You rem you've rem remained much the same as well, Melisandre. How do you mean? Even in our youth, it was obvious you were never quite like the other nobles. While you may have struggled with decorum at times, you bore a keen eye for seeing matters as they truly were. Did I now? Tell me, do you recall what happened the eve of that banquet? A thief found his way into the manor proper, past every last one of our skilled sentries. And while the rest of us strive to understand how, how, your gaze never left a qu quite young gentleman in attendance. At the time, it seemed as though you were simply infatuated with him. Yet it later grew clear that he was the one who had helped the thief inside. Somehow you had suspected the man from the very beginning. Had I? I can't say I remember it myself. And though I welcome the praise, we both know what happened afterwards. I said I was Zenoria rather than defend my home. So please, don't act like I'm some wonderful judge of character. If you insist. Aw. These are all great. I love them. Um, do I have... I don't know. I don't think I have enough items to 
get all to do this? I might, but let's see. I do not. I am nowhere close. I have all the sardines, but nothing else. Seems like I'm also only getting one item now instead of like, you know, I used to get a lot more, like three. I don't know, maybe that's something to do with me always repeating that one mission or something. Maybe that's why it's not as much. But what do I know? Okay, so that's in there. What's gonna suck is all the cobblestone I'll need, or whatever the the stone I need. That's like, ah, oh, yes, use this stone to build the bridge, but also use it for this place to deliver it. So, all right. Um, I believe. I. I think, you know what, let's do this one first, Beyond the Swirling Sands, and then we'll do the Battle of Adopti. Like I said, these are my own stomping grounds. How about I give you the Grand Tour? Night witches and gladiators. Dragonhold's desert is a dangerous land of exiles and criminals, as well as the place Al Albin grew up. Worried for those he cares about, Albin asks Elaine to survey the desert and offer Alfred to act as his guide. It's just as Albin said. We should have no trouble passing safely. And we finally have a clean source of water. This oasis is a godsend amidst all this sand. Hey, he's back. What news do you bring? All sorted. We're fine long as we're here. Meaning we're not fine everywhere else. Sorry to say it after all the hot air I talked, but... Yep. Turns out we got a problem. How so? Well, you know how I said I got an in here? Old bandit pal of mine by the name of Magellan. The guy practically runs the place. And he does it well. At least he did. Rumor has it, he's a whole different man now. Don't know what happened to him, but he's been picking fights with other gangs for the past six months. That sounds awfully familiar. Can't say for sure, but Zanoira probably got to him. Is there no way to avoid conflict? Not if I can't work something out. Anyone steps foot on his land and they're as good as buried. But I'm not stopping till I know what happened to him. Why he's doing this? Mind making a little detour to his keep? The choice is yours, as long as you're the one charting the course. And if Magellan is under Zenoira's control, we may just be able to loosen the spell. Up, boss. We got two roads here. You can take the bandits' keep. The way up north is full of sorcerers, magic types, turned over to a thieving life. The southern road, on the other hand, has got some of the toughest outlaws you ever seen. When I hear, two sides have been going at it ever since Magellan flipped. Then there's the ruins up north, apparently claimed by a night gone rogue. 
Rumor has it they've been causing the town all sorts of problems. Oh, in here. Light feather. These sands will slow us down good. We'll use one of these and it'll be your back on solid ground. So, so you know, my prince, flying units like mine won't be affected by the desert either. Do with that what you will. Thank you both. I suppose all that remains now is to deploy. Real quick first. We should be saying archers against the wyvern, yeah? You would expect as such, but the shield... But the shield their fighter bears will render that tactic frankly powerless. In that case, why not send a sorcerer instead? Wyvern knights are equally as vulnerable to magic as they are to arrows. Huh. Yeah, no idea. Let's give it a shot, Elaine! Okay, well... My moment has finally come. I'll make my mark. Of course. The Cornian militia fights. I'm ready. Understood. Um... Pose. Witness true chivalry. Your will shall be done. I depart anon. Back for more, are you? Damn barbarians. Don't know when to quit. This desert is ours, and we're never handing it over. I hear though your magic guys are supposed to be smart. The only people who just enjoy the ones you've got the strength to win. Don't find out if that's you or not. Do you realize who you defy? Sorry about that, I was on the phone. A chance to earn some praise. Let's see what happens here. Ever weaker. I can help. Not so useless now, am I? Yeah, it kind of sucks that my majority of my. Hmm. It really sucks because I can't. I don't want to send these guys out, but. Ah, uh, no, 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 no. I ride for Cornea. What shall I do? It shall be done. Damn it, I can't see my own feet through all this sand. This bass will be on us in no time flat. Get to the watchtowers. Visibility be better if you get a little height. You're in the man. Let's get moving, Elaine. 
Careful, you may get burnt. Vicar fades! Chance to earn some praise. I'm just gonna. Did you see that, mother? Perfect. Now I'm actually gonna send another. Actually, you might be fine. This God. rose bears thorns. What would you ask of me? It shall be done. What's next? I'm listening. I'll see what I can do. Careful, you may get burnt. I never doubted myself. Okay, now I'm gonna have you. What rest. do you need? I shall teach you the lunacy of your ways. Well, here's the thing. What are your orders, my prince? As decreed. Do you need something? Heading there now. Let me at him. Need something? I think I'll try my best. Easy. To prepare yourselves. Get to the um Victory. I'm ever in your service. I depart. Phew. Glad that's cleared up. No relaxing just yet. You never know when the next one's gonna roll in. Try remember where the enemies are now before it's too late. I shall not disappoint. Well, that's a uh, that's a little discouraging. That what shall I do? Yeah, I'm ready. Right. They seek to attack me. Yeah, you haven't seen you out in the dunes before. Think of this little toll for crossing. Anyway, thanks for doing business. Come back here, thief! Try saying flying you in after him, your highness. We can move through the sand just as easily as anywhere else. I mean, I wish I had a flying unit. I, I should have swapped you. Actually, can I change that now? I probably can't. I could probably only do it in here, can I? Yeah, uniformation. They train upon me.
Tisn't safe here. I am within their range. A perilous battle indeed. Behold the valor of a knight. What would you ask of me? Setting off? I'm listening. Of course. I wager we can use this. Your will shall be done. At once. Got a fresh mark coming our way, boss. Dodo, the brave or stupid to come stomping your neck of the dunes. Not that matters. Time will show more mistakes they're making. Do you realize who you defy? A futile endeavor. It appears I've still room to grow. I shall teach you the lunacy of your ways. I shall not shy from battle. A futile endeavor. Skip it. I fear they outclass me. <sighs> Don't know how. I shall teach you the lunacy of your ways. Is that all? What are your orders, my prince? I depart anon. Your so wait, no, you go after these guys. As decreed. I fight on. For now, it shall be done. They aim for me. <gasps> Stand before me. It was fate which brought us here. Quite troubling. I depart. I grow weary. My gratitude. I never miss my target. You'd best make this count. Bold of you to stand against I'm me. here too. I'll support you. I'll pierce you clean through. The end of this brutal war dropped. Take notes, Lex. King Call. Grants 100% critical rate of analysis. See now. Nice. Do you realize who you defy? I'll not let Clive outdo me. No, it kind of sucks. This means trouble. A futile endeavor. Behold the valor of a Let me help. 
I'm here too. You'd best make this count. I shall teach you the lunacy of your ways. Yes, smoke nut. Vanquished. Your will shall be done. Ooh, that's not good. What are your orders, my prince? Your will shall be done. At once. Prepare yourselves. Oh fuck, I just realized like quite troubling. I grow weary. Shit, that's my life. I'll prove my worth. Yeah, I'm up. Sure, sure. I shall not disappoint. <sighs> There's nothing on here that gives me a formidable adversary. I'll support you. to move have you need of me I shall never fail victory what shall I do I depart a chance to earn I'm here too Did you see that, mother? I'm not ready to die. Yes, I concur. Try me. I can't move another muscle. I must distinguish myself. Endeavor. All right, let's do this. Definitely who's on the team and their formation as well is actually very important too. It's just... Oh, I don't like that. There's no need for us to get take downs with that with that quick cover. Because he would have dodged the attack anyway. Saw 
saw that. God, I lucked out for her staying alive as long as she did. I require a respite. I'll prove my worth. This should be it. I'll make my mark. I'll see what I can do. I shall not disappoint. It shall be done. A futile endeavor. It shames me to admit it. I have victory claim for the liberation. No Come, we march onward. You are so fast, pal. Find an ousting Miguel and I want to come with. Desert Code, you know. Says you always gotta throw in with the winner. In that case, we would be honored happy. What are your orders, my prince? Careful, you make it. I'll support you. I never doubted myself. Do you need something? Understood. I actually did it! I shall not falter. Get the fuck out of here. According to plan. What would you ask of me? By your command. Actually, I shall not you. Disappoint. What power? What would you ask of me? And I can't control you, can I? Nope. I'm ever in your service. It shall be done. Need something? Easy. Service of the loyal, what would you ask? As you wish. I never miss my target. Nah. Love how it's like, oh yeah, these guys also do damage to the wyverns. And it's like my magic didn't even hit them, so I was like, well, fuck you. Ooh, that's... That's actually a nice touch there. No surprise there. See, Chloe? I can do stuff. See, Chloe? I can do stuff. Wait, please, I surrender. Oh, yeah? Could have sworn you put up more of a fight than that. What if you weren't here? Listen, Albin. Something's wrong with Miguel. Magellan. I'm not sure what it is, but if anyone can put a stop to it, it's you. I'll ask our friends up north to lend a hand myself. As for the bandits down south, well, that's on you. So, what do you say? We have a deal? If it means not having blades at each other's throats, I'm all for it. Come, Elaine. But of course. What would you have us do, Fair Rider? Only one thing. Keep me safe while I'm flying over there. Can't exactly have my chat if I'm burnt to a crisp, so. Who's my target? Heading there now. Have you need of me? It shall be done. Do you need something? I'm grateful for the support. Gaze upon the face of your demise. A trivial undertaking awaiting your command. By your word.
I've taken it. Stealing our gold, are you? Uh, I guess nobody's got easy these days. Let's just call it a little thank you for sparing my life. So far, so good. Don't mean to alarm you, Your Highness, but our command post is on the verge of being captured. My destination. I shall never fail. We mean they've reached their destination. I have them going somewhere else. What would you ask of me? I shall not disappoint. Hey, boss. You have company. More moths to the flame. Hmm. Fine then. Let's show them what we do to interlopers. Your will shall be done, as decreed. We may be able to use this. Stand before me! It was fate which brought us here. Need something? Easy. I have arrived. You face me. A fine bout. Who's my target? I'm ready. Oh, I can't deploy. Mm, okay. I'm listening. Yes, I concur. We've taken it as our own. Yeah, fun ain't good in there. Take whatever you want, long as it helps. Shall never fail. Prepare yourselves. Oh, dear Lord. I can ride no further. What shall I do? Have you need of me? Setting off. Looks like I win. I shall not disappoint. By your command. Yeah? Sure, sure. Knew that was coming. Hold on, Camilla. I have a proposition for you. Fourteen Magellan, are we? I couldn't have come up with a finer plan myself. Hey, well, do with my army what you will. Yeah, and it's practically got the whole damn kingdom after him. No point sticking around here, though. Come on, Magellan's waiting for us. I'm up. I stand triumphant. I could really use a rest. Yeah? Heading over. Have you need of me? I shall not disappoint. I'll prove my worth. Yeah. I'll not fail you. As you wish. What are your orders, my prince? At once. I shall hold nothing back. Come. Come. I've not 
chosen my grave yet. What shall I do? I depart. There is time yet to claim victory. A fortuitous find. Hot cross bun. Have you need of me? It shall be done. Do you realize who you defy? A feudal endeavor. A lacking bout, frankly. This ground belongs to the Liberation. What would you ask? Very well. Gaze upon the face of your demise. Let's keep going. I'm up. I'll not fail you. By your word. Your orders, sir. Behold the valor of a knight. Now. Now. <laughs> Superior strike. Oh, damn. I definitely need to swap those their units. Need something? Easy. I shall not shy from battle. The winds of fate blow at our backs. What would you ask of me? By your command. So far, so good. Awaiting your command. I claim these lands for the liberation. I can't move any farther. No point being scared. Only a fool would raise their sword to the Empire. Yeah! <laughs> Magic missile. I can help. Yeah, not a good one. Your will shall be done. Yeah, that won't be smart. Stand a chance. What would you ask? Very well. Have you need of me? Setting off. At least just to do damage. Hold on. Bet that hurt. Before I keep having you pursue. I'm up. Yeah, that would that'd be dumb. What do you need?
I'll see what I can do. Um, need something? I'll not let Clive outdo me. Now. Your will shall be done. I shall not disappoint. Just so that damage is done to them. I'll not let Clive outdo me. My power. Something. Our time grows short. Come. You don't stand it. I shall teach you. Behold the valor of a knight. I shall hold nothing back. <laughs> Never thought I'd get the chance to smack you around a bit. I'm gonna enjoy this. Stand true! Stand true! I can't do shit. I fight in me yet. Have you need of me? Gaze upon the face Let's of your finish this. Eyes. Undertaking. And there we go. I don't know if it was the best way to get it done, but it helped. If I'd have anything to do with the likes of you, this guy's no Magellan. Greedy bastard wouldn't forget a single gold he's owed. Good to hear you like the guy at least. Do it, boss. Wake up. Last I remember was meeting up with this night pal of mine. Name's Gloucester. Gloucester! He wasn't alone. Some old bag of bones was tagging along. And before I knew it, he and his damn magic had me. <laughs> Ugh. Embarrassing as all hell. You're Elaine, yeah? Looks like I owe you one. Bet you remember me now, too. Like I'd ever forget. Hope you're not showing up empty-handed for both our sakes. Come on, out with it. <laughs> There's the old Magellan. 
Yeah, yeah. Anyway. <laughs> I like him. on the master plans, boss? I'm in real debt here with you saving my skin and all. And I'm not gonna rest till I've paid it back in full. <laughs> That's just the kind of guy I am. That's just the kind of guy I am. Hells yeah! Magellan. Magellan. All right. Jeez, that was a sh that was a long one. Wait, where the hell am I? Uh, is that the one that lasted? Probably. I don't know. Okay, it is. Okay. Thanks for that, boss. I don't know when I pay you back someday. Promise. up there. Oh, good. Howl Corn Ash. Love getting that shit. Then over here, okay. I could hear across the desert, did you? Me? I got caught in the worst sandstorms you've ever seen. Figured they find my bones bleached and burned. Well, then this long-haired swordsman shows up out of nowhere and guides me all the way here. Frank, I owe the man my life. Huh. Wonder who he's talking about. I always like climbing things. Yeah, hey, found something. Watchman's buckler, eh? So there has to be like some place here I can Let's find another our old corn ash, yep. Thingus. I mean, follow before my chickens escaped from their coop this morning. It's only natural that you worry about such a thing. We'd be glad to round them up if we have the chance. I remember seeing it up here. Deliver all of them.
Joe, thank you enough for making these deliveries. Life in town's a bit less grim, at least for now. Yeah, sure. Try to steal this town from under my nose, will you? I'll show you it won't come easy. I think I'll come in just fine enough. Might as well grab this. Oh, it's you again. The sins you bear are heavy indeed. Foul knaves who prey upon the weak and helpless. Your souls belong not on earth, but with the writhing in agony and amid eternal damnation. And I, the Aaron Knight Laurent, shall deliver you to its boundless flames. Sin, so not. the right call. Watch what royalty can do. <laughs> I wield this lance for the your decree made manifest. Good choice. They won't escape. Moving out. You don't stand a chance. <laughs> now that they each have three, okay, it's a little more like... Cut you in two! As if I could lose. That's what you get. That's what you get when you let your heart win. My moment has finally come. A chance to earn some praise. Have I proven myself yet? Out of my way. Out of my way. It's not no. personal. No. How embarrassing. How Lay embarrassing. Down. How embarrassing. Yo, that's a sick I'm ass move. My time. That's what you get. I'll make my mark. Yes, I concur. I won't disappoint. Is that all? Kneel before me. Oh, I should have done the magic assist. Oh well. Bold of you to stand against me. I wonder if this guy will, I wonder if he'll actually join us at some point or if he will only join us during these liberation missions. Anyway, I won't complain too much. Keep our focus. Just tell me what to do. Loud and clear. Surely this counts for something. You won't make this mistake twice.
Damn. Facing me was your first mistake. <sighs> this is nothing. <laughs> I think I've gotten a little better at this. I like Grim. I definitely should probably start buying like actual items instead of like just weapons. Prince Elaine and Hodric too. Have you found peace, Renault? Hmm. Unable to bear the weight of my sins, I've traveled these lands in search of some minor shred of atonement. But it was all an egoistic crusade in the end. There is no unmaking the suffering these people have endured under Zenoiran rule. Not even claiming the vile heads of their oppressors can bring the masses the solace they deserve. They, and the very land itself, grow weary from a decade of war. Famine, plague, and the greed of men now prevail. And I... Inadequate as I am alone, could never hope to end their gruesome reign. Before such cruel reality, I am utterly powerless. If I may, Sir Renault, no action can hope to quell the flames of regret. They burn on, ever darkening our minds and consuming our pasts. Yet, their blaze is not the end of all things. You would see that, should you only turn your gaze forward. Forward to hope, and to the future of all those we hold dear. For there can be no greater treasure than that. You said such words yourself, sir. That conviction was ever the paradigm I aspired to achieve. You've grown stronger than you realize, Clive. It's just as you say. No action I take can undo the sins I've wrought upon this continent. Yet with the rage that burns deep within me, perhaps I can lay to rest the man I once was and begin this life anew. Prince Elaine, I, Renault, shall serve as your spear until the day comes that we've shattered Zenoira's foul tyranny over this land. As long as I live and breathe, I am yours to command. Renault has joined the Liberation Army. Nice! It's awesome. Save. Thanks for riding those bat roots out of here. What the hell, you put on? I doubt the bats will come back anytime soon. Magnificently kind, giant you did there. We'd still be living in a rubble if one for you. I'm glad to do it. I'm actually curious if there's. Well, that's actually that way is towards an area I can't get to. Plus, I have no idea where this last chicken's at. Yeah. Oh, I missed that. I don't know. Well, actually, I do know. Oh, 
There's holocorn ashes. Hold up a sec. It's quiet. Too quiet, if you ask me. Got a bad feeling about this. What seems to be the matter? Ray, we walked straight into a real bind. Sonora. Ah, uh, not them. Long time no see, Lisa. Doing okay? Got some nerves asking that after everything you've done to her. And I can explain all that, promise. Enough of your lies. You don't kill a tree like you where you stand. This isn't going well, Magellan. Who exactly is this Lisa person you speak of? She's my sister, my number two. Back when I was heading the group. Sorry for blending in like this, but he's telling the truth, I promise. Alvin, where have you been all this time? Not that it matters. Do you even know what he's been through, what we've been through? What it's like watching friends get cut down by your own boss? Yeah, say I do. I get why you don't want to trust him. And Miguel's not the only one. Same thing's happening all over the damn continent. What? You're saying you know why? This is gonna hear about this. That's what I've been telling you. Am I leading the way? One bit, follow me. Come on, boss is right in here. Captain, it's Magellan. He says he's back to normal and, uh, well, he's here. What? What? Hey there, Liza. Hope I didn't make you worry too much. You've got some real guts showing your face around here. You got any idea the kind of damage you've dealt to our men? Not to mention our morale. I do, yeah. And I'm real sorry for that. But I wasn't doing it because I wanted to. Those Zenoira bastards were controlling my mind and yanking me around like a damn puppet on a string. Sure they were. You ask me, it's all sounding a bit too convenient. And if you are telling the truth, what's to say you're not still under their control? You could be here to finish us off for all I know. Easy there. He's not bluffing, Liza. I swear by it. And I thought you were dead. And I thought you were dead. Hmm. You don't look like a fake. Still as dashing as ever, right? Still a buffoon, more like. <laughs> but I doubt that'll ever change. Fine. If Aubin sees fit to trust you, I'll just have to do the same. Not like we'd be able to fight back anyways. I can count the men I've got left on my damned fingers. How's that possible? I'm sure you remember Gloucester. How could I forget? Guy's the Black Knight of Dragonal. Prince Ludwig's personal card at that. Us Sandors would never survive without him helping us out. What happened to him? Same story as Magellan here. He just lost it one day. Started attacking people for no reason. And with all the raids going on, whole towns have started up and fleeing the desert entirely. A familiar tale. Yeah. Sounds like he fell for the same trick I did. Boss! Boss! What's wrong? It's Gloucester! He's coming this way! Must have caught wind of the Liberation showing up. Come on, we retreat west to the village, then strike from there. You plan to launch a counteroffensive? We're as good as buried if we don't. And the only way I'm willing to go down is swinging. Please, boss. That ring of yours can save him, I'm sure of it. I assure you, you needn't convince me. I won't allow this brutality to continue. Are we going right into it? John's return, has he? And fights with rebels if our scouts are to be believed. God. We've also got word that lies herself makes for the Oasis. If we intercept her march and take the town as our own. Soon this barren land shall belong to us. Ah. 
There we go. That's what it is. Ah, shit. Okay, well, I guess I'm forced into doing it. But I'll save that for the next part, guys, because this actually went on way longer than I thought it would. So, anyway, guys, thank you all so much for watching this video. Guys, if you like the video, please give that like button a click. And comment down below what you like about the video. Didn't like about the video. And let me know, guys, what you think of the new bandits. I'm not a big fan of the, of the uh, uh, sand area, but maybe I can adjust some of the uh, units a little bit. We'll see. But, yeah, I like it. I like this a lot. And as always, guys, hit the subscribe button so you don't miss a beat. And subscribe to my main channel, too. That's in the description below. As well as follow me on Twitter. Both of my main Twitter, the RPG Kim Kid Twitter, are in there, too. Thank you all so much for watching once again. And I'll see you all next time.